friend, it's Debbie the Restorer. If you've been following along, hi again and thanks for tuning in. Today's episode is all about hardware. Today I'm going to show you how to remove scratches as well as how to replace your iconic coach turn lock. First of all, I'm going to take my trusty knife here. I've used this for years so it's pretty dull. Not a big risk of injury. And I just slide this underneath these teeth, lift those up. I usually just do three. I'll slide this in here, lift, and that should pop right out. Set that aside. This one can be a little bit more difficult. Get it to where I can see that clearly. It has little teeth here, two of those. Again, just use the edge of the knife. I just do one side and come to the other side and pull and it pops right out. Next thing we'll do is take off this hang tag and ball chain, set that aside. And I always use a used dryer sheet, used because they're soft and they don't have product on them. First thing I like to do is to get rid of this verdigris. It will stain things and it's too sticky to be able to polish well. So get rid of that from each piece. Okay, now we're ready to polish. First thing I'm going to do is use this four-way nail buffer. I try to find not the coarsest side, but the next coarsest side. And all you'll do is gently and quickly brush this in one direction. You can see those scratches starting to lift. I'll rotate it. Luckily, Coach Hardware is solid brass, so it enables you to be able to polish this. And finally, use your 2x2 two two jeweler's pad. That'll give a beautiful eye shine to the hardware. Oh, good as new. For the turn lock, it's not clear coated. I'm just going to use the jeweler's pad on it. And these don't show, but I like to always give them a nice polish in them. And for the ball chain, I just slide it through. Now, good as new. And to replace these, we're just going to reverse what we did. I'll start with the turn lock. I like to straighten these teeth out first. Makes it easier for those to go back through the leather. Make sure it's nice and tight so it doesn't wriggle. Again, straighten your teeth out. Grab those teeth. Give it a nice quick polish again. Turn your hang tag. Give these D rings a nice polish. They're pretty easy to do and quick. All that hardware looks like new. Okay guys, I think that's all the time we have for today. Thanks so much for watching. And remember, love your leather and your hardware and they'll love you forever. On the next episode, I'm gonna show you how to repair a separated coach hang tag. See you there.